Good morning, guys. Captain Dylan Hubbard here at Hubbard's Marina with a cloudless sunrise view and a absolutely cool, dry, perfect start to the day here inside John's Pass at Hubbard's Marina. And I couldn't be more excited this morning as we are only one day, 48 hours from opening back up. That's right. We've been closed since March 23rd and Monday, May 4th. All that changes. The closure ends Monday, March 4th here at Hubbard's Marina. We're looking forward to going out and getting people some salt air, some sunshine, and some on-the-water therapy. So hopefully you can join us this upcoming week here at Hubbard's Marina. If you do plan to join us, we do have some new policies and procedures in place due to the virus. So upon reopening Monday morning, May 4th, uh, things will be a little unique here around Hubbard's Marina for a while while we're dealing with this phase one and phase two opening. So we've got some pretty interesting policies and procedures. You could check those out on our website, hubbardsmarina.com, click info. And then from there, you can click that COVID-19 policy and procedure page. So go to hubbardsmarina.com, click info, then click the COVID-19 policy and procedure page. If you're interested to learn more about what we're doing to try our best to keep our Hubbards Marina family, our staff, our clients, our fishing friends, everyone safe while you visit us uh, the upcoming weeks here around Hubbards Marina. Things like limiting capacity are all listed on that page, the different sanitizing things. We highly encourage the use of masks. Uh, we also mandatorily enforce that social distancing rule between groups. That's one thing a lot of people are confused on so if you got a buddy, uh, or let's say you got a roommate, so you and your roommate want to come fishing, you both live in the same house, you travel in the same car, when you get to Hubbard's Marina, you don't have to socially distance from your roommate. Uh, that that uh, social distancing rule applies to other groups. So you and your roommate can fish right next to each other or go to the island and sit next to each other on the boat. Uh, but you have to stay six feet from other groups. That's how that social distancing rule works. And that's what we're going to be enforcing, guys. Our office is now one way only. We've got sneeze guards in place. We've got tape on the floor. We got all the precautions we could possibly take, we've taken. We're adding a bunch of signage to the boats and to the front of the office and around the office all in the name of your safety guys so hopefully you can come out and join us this week or in the near future once you're able to travel or comfortable traveling we'd love to see you we do have a tuesday 39 hour fishing trip this week we've got a friday 44 hour full moon fishing trip this week we've got the wednesday 12 hour extreme we got half day trips 10 hour trips plenty of options but they are super limited capacities we're limiting those big party boats to 25 percent capacity so only 30 people can get on those big boats they're licensed for 120 they're 78 rod holders normally we allow up to 65 we're only allowing 30 to keep the quality of the trip high and to keep it at 25 25% capacity of our COI number. So make sure you check that out. Book early because spots will fill quickly. Uh, definitely looking forward to a great week. That gift certificate deal is unfortunately over. We ran that for almost 40 days since March 23rd. It ended April 30th. So if you missed out on a gift certificate, you missed out. We're not extending that deal as we've been talking about this past week. So I apologize if you did not get an opportunity to grab one. Uh, hopefully everybody who wanted one was able to get them. Now, uh, don't forget, tomorrow night we've got our live stream fishing show. So Sunday night, 8.30 p.m. Every Sunday night at 8.30 p.m. You can catch that live fishing show on our Hubbard's Marina Facebook and YouTube channel. So hopefully you can tune in uh, tomorrow night for that live show. We'd love to have you. We're going to be talking fishing talking tips tricks and more and giving away free trips so hopefully you can join us sunday night 8 30 p.m that's tomorrow night at 8 30 p.m 
Uh, what else am I forgetting? Oh, as far as reopening, remember we are doing that uh, social distancing rule. So we have to enforce social distancing. So what that means is if you've booked one of those 39-hour fishing trips, 10-hour trips, 12-hour trips, whatever trip you've booked and you've picked a spot, keep in mind that those fishing spots are not guaranteed during the month of May when we're under this new COVID-19 policy and procedure. Because of that, we have to spread groups out of six feet apart or more. So in order to do that, guys, we might have to be moving people around out of fishing spots. So be aware of that when you come down you got to be flexible you got to be fluid in order for us to stay open and to operate legally we have to enforce that social distancing there's going to be a lot of enforcement on the water there's going to be sheriffs up and down our beaches all over the water uh, monitoring how businesses are enforcing and complying with these social distancing rules so if we get out there and all of a sudden we get pulled over and people aren't six feet apart groups aren't six feet apart we can run into problems and we may be forced to close again so help us stay open help us continue to offer the opportunity to escape onto the water and enjoy some fun in the sun and the way you can help us is by being flexible being understanding and uh, working with us to make sure that we can continue to offer these beautiful opportunities to get out and enjoy this wonderful weather we're having it is sunny and low 70s this morning uh, tomorrow is going to be much of the same probably a high in the low 80s the next two days this week monday when we reopen the weather is spectacular monday tuesday and wednesday we got a full moon coming up at the end of this first week so Thursday, Friday, that full moon occurs. Should be incredible fishing here at the start of the week, especially Tuesday. So hopefully you can get out and join us and take advantage of this great weather, great fishing. Also, state parks open on uh, Monday. So if you want to join us for an Egmont Key trip, a Shell Key trip, we are opening our Shell Key Ferry and Egmont Key Ferry Monday as well. So we got island trips, we've got dolphin trips, we've got sunset cruises, we've got fishing trips, we've got it all starting Monday, May 4th. But again, social distancing is strictly enforced, so make sure you're aware of that. And uh, hopefully you come out ready to have a good time because we're ready to enjoy this beautiful weather and the great time out in the water. Come enjoy some fun in the sun, some salt air, some UV light, and uh, have a good time doing it. So let's, let's go fishing. Let's go out to the island. Let's go dolphin watching. We'll see you this coming week. We'll see you tomorrow night for our live stream show. And don't forget, if you're too busy to go fishing, you're just too darn busy, guys. Have a great day.